that's what professionals do when they're trying to record audio, video, and visuals, and shit all at the same time. They clap so that they can sync the the files. I know my shit, man. Anyways, hey, we're playing um Eastward. A game where you travel east. That's my that's my initial um Yep, that's my initial six folders. So it's hanging here. It's a little cold in this room, but I'm excited. Once upon a time, in the farthest reaches of the continent, there sat a prosperous kingdom with a soaring tower that reached up the, reached the clouds up above. For many years, the kingdom lived in peace until following the tragic death of their king. The demon king disguised himself as the chancellor and claimed the kingdom for himself. Sealing off the castle from the rest of the kingdom, he locked the princess away within the tower. Day after day, the princess wept, gazing out the window at her poor kingdom below. Zelda, is that you? Around that time, a young knight from a faraway land was squeezing the salt water from his cloak. Looking up from where he'd washed ashore on the beach, he saw the castle in the distance. That castle would be his destination and the start of his adventure. Oh, I was about to say, like, that is Zelda, no? Kuroda. I lost again? But I even had the full s attack skill this time. A stupid demon king. How are you supposed to beat him? Hmm. Guess there's really no way unless you get more party members. Oh crap. Look at the time. Time for school. Let's play again after school, okay? Sure thing. See you later. They were definitely playing Breath of the Wild. I gotta go wake John up. That's a puffer coat if I've ever seen one. Look at his skinny legs. <laughs> this is cute. I like it. Now it's not the time to cook. What if I wanted to eat something, John? What if I was hungry, man? If I was supposed to leave. Okay, well, I was supposed to leave. Prologue The World Above. John, come on! The bell already rang. If we don't get back to the dig site, the mayor's gonna pay dock your pay. Refrigerate your memories here. But when you take them out again, will the new you really be you? What? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Wait, what? I don't know. 
I don't want to save my memories. Who's this? Hey, sir. Hank. Up at the crack of dawn? Bleed for every coin you earn. Must be tough being a digger. A what? What did you just call me, boy? Sorry. I'm so sorry. Hey, guys. Men are the absolute worst. But aren't you seeing somebody right now? Can't say that's very convincing coming from you. My molar is different. And you expect us to believe that? <laughs> it's called love. You wouldn't even understand if I told you, dear. Okay. Where am I going? To the to the flag. I want to explore. Let me explore. Stop trying to rush me. Shouldn't y'all be at school? Mm. <laughs> Shouldn't you be at work or something by now? I knew it. You're one of those types, aren't you? Those types? Yeah, a loser. Can never hold a job, am I right? Sir, you're literally six. And we are not living in peak society. Like, this is clearly post modern age. You know, this is rebuilding era. I'm sorry. <laughs> Every day, it's the same damn thing. Ain't nothing to do down here but sleep. Maybe I'll get lucky and dream up the sun today. Dream me up the sun today. John! Looking suave today as always. He does look pretty clean. In a hurry again today? I'd expect no less from pot, pot crocs. <clears throat> from Pot Croc Isles, number one digger. I don't like digger. Like, is it not mining? I'll see y'all. That is how I get to where I need to go, but I kind of want to explore more. Hey. If it isn't little Sam, made any new friends lately? Still want to go to the world above? I don't know why, but that sounded very condescending. Long time since I've seen your face around here, John. It's not often you do your shopping here. Anyway, what can I get you today? I have enough to buy it. Should I buy it? about that um I guess it'll I guess it'll figure itself out let's go come on well hey John what are you doing here? Does he have a tail? Ooh, not gonna lie. I'm done talking. I'll come back when I feel like talking again.
Yo, I really like the digger thing. <laughs> You're one of them diggers, ain't ya? Like, excuse me? <laughs> I mean, I'm gonna stop reading the subtitles. I'm still gonna speak, you know? But I'll read them whenever I feel like I have to, you know? I don't feel like reading all of them. So I could have been opening them this entire time. Look at me, smarty pants. I know I saw another one, I know I saw one. I have to get down there a secret way. Okay, understood. Maybe if I drink water. Give me a sec. Have to one adjust myself. And two get my water. Okie dokie, back to the grind. <clears throat> kept the diary like I actually kept one I have two journals I have a bunch of random thoughts in them but if I kept one and in the future somebody found it and read it I don't know how I would feel you know would it be cool kind of but would it be a little bit embarrassing probably But I really think I might start keeping a, a daily journal. Hyun. Oh, come on. Don't be so stingy. I'm only borrowing it. Two days tops. I'll give it back as soon as I finish it. You say that every time. Yet somehow... I've never gotten anything back. That's, well... <laughs> well, well, well. John's here. Mr. Punctuality as always. Sir? Your wash must have been carved by God's God the time God the time himself. <clears throat> Your watch must have been chopped and <clears throat> <clears throat> yeah, your watch must have been carved by God of Time himself. There we go. And you're looking as adorable as always, Sam. Do you still remember what I taught you? Of course. Over pit, under rock, buried treasure, round the clock. 
in the mind, rocks go blast. Safety first or you won't last. Gotta dig, gotta dig. Dig to make those riches flow. Bravo! You'll make an excellent digger one day, Sam. She sure will. Even better than John, I'd say. Damn. We've got a problem. A big fucking problem. Slugs! John! Thank God you're here. Come with me. Now wait a god darn minute. You shouldn't be running out pell mill like little Sammy. It's dangerous in there. You just stay right here with your Uncle Chag. We'll, prote we'll protect you from them slugs. Oh, bro, that's too funny. A very good point. Sam, would you like to hear about when the mayor went up against Evil Dragon? I missed a word there. Not that one again. <clears throat> Come on, John. The slugs are in the cave to the west. Who's this not knows me? Oh, hell no. Nah. There you are, John. The slugs are in the cave to the west. I, he just told me. And you, go find the key to the storeroom. We'll need the bombs in there to take care of the slug nests. Like, can you wipe your nose, sir? What are you waiting for? Old Chuckles is already headed for the storeroom. I'll be uh, right behind you. I don't have any weapons. Nobody taught me how to fight. Like, you just send me up? Is that what the plan is? Oh, I got me a pen. Stupid slugs really thought they were gonna ambush me. Who, who is it? John? Is that you, John? Yes, it is me, John. No answer. Must be John. John, don't open the door. The slugs are slap. <clears throat> Those slugs are sapping our electricity. Unless you take care of them, we won't be able to turn the lights back on. All right. Good thing I know I can. Um. No, I can't hit the box. I can drag the boxes so. though. Hey man. Oh shit. The nests, John. If you don't bomb their nests, they'll just keep coming back. John! Okay, 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 okay. to do that sir I like John's picture down there do you see it? it's kind of clean 
Maybe I did the wrong thing. There we go. We'll try that. <laughs> that was such a cute little dance. So cute, that little move he does. And my weapons menu. Bomb box, my backpack, ten bombs. Okay. What does this do? Do I need a battery for that one? question still is, why does this man still only have a pan to fight with? Like, why is that his weapon of choice? A pan. Don't, don't, don't eat me! <laughs> Hold on one sec. Sorry. Damn. Okay, once again, stop. <laughs> 